Your next object is a cow. I will hand this one to you. Thank you. It is closer to you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Now, <laughs> when did you first learn about cow attacks, Mr. Bill Bryson? I was crossing a, a, a field. I was walking part of the South Downs Way. Uh, we were uh, near Brighton, and I was doing it with a, a journalist from a walking magazine. I had just taken on the position of president of the campaign to protect rural England, and he was doing a profile of me, and he thought it would be interesting to do it as part of a walk. And as I was going to be doing for pleasure of the South Downs Way uh, anyway, he came and joined us for me and two friends for on, on, on the South Downs Way for a, a day. And it was from him I learned. He, as we climbed over a stile and we emerged in a new field, he said, he said in this kind of very grave voice, look out, there's a, take care, there's a bull over there. And I was totally astounded. I thought, we're in the South Downs Way. This is a national footpath. There can't be bulls in the field. And he said, no, absolutely. And that got us to talking about cows and, and, and bulls. And, and then this guy, the journalist for Walking Magazine, he told me that the real danger is cows themselves, that cows attack and kill far more people than bulls do. And, and this totally astounded me because for the last, you know, 30 years that I've been walking, I've just, you know, been shaking a stick at cows and get out of the way, you know, and <laughs> I'm quite boldly chasing them off, not knowing that they might turn on me uh, <laughs> on mass. And uh, anyway, so the next thing I did was I, I um, Googled cow attacks. And uh, when I got home the next day and found out that indeed cows do attack a lot. And when they do attack and kill somebody, it, it always makes the papers, always. It's always front page news or at least, you know, on the first couple of page, pages of the newspaper. And that, I decided on reflection, actually gave me a lot of comfort to live in a country where when cows attack and kill someone, it makes, it makes the national newspapers. Because in my country, if you want to make the national newspapers, you know you have to get out an automatic weapon and kill <laughs> lots and lots of people. So the very fact that cow attacks um, are, are newsworthy here is, is sort of in, in, indicative of what a serene and happy nation this is.